Let's discuss one of the most important graphs in inverse trigonometric functions that is graph of y is equal to sin inverse of sin x. We have y is equal to sin inverse of sin x. Uh, let's take sin both sides. We have sin y is equal to sin x. Now to relate y and x we solve this equation. What is solution of this equation? प्लस वन में हमने इस टाइप के इक्वेशंस का जनरल सॉल्यूशन स्टडी किया था क्या होता है वो y इज इक्वल टू एन पाई माइनस वन पावर एन एक्स वेर एन बिलोंग्स टू z. z इज सेट ऑफ इंटीजर्स नाउ व्हाट इज रेंज ऑफ दिस फंक्शन y इज इक्वल टू साइन इनवर्स ऑफ साइन एक्स का रेंज क्या होगा साइन इनवर्स फंक्शन है तो उसका रेंज क्या होता है माइनस फाइव बाय टू टू फाइव बाय टू सो वी हैव वैल्यूज ऑफ वाई बिलोंग्स टू माइनस फाइव बाय टू टू फाइव बाय टू लेट्स फाइंड डोमेन ऑफ दिस फंक्शन हाउ यू आर्ग्यू फॉर फाइंडिंग द डोमेन वी हैव साइन इनवर्स ऑफ साइन एक्स दिस फंक्शन इज डिफाइंड वेन साइन एक्स बिलोंग्स टू माइनस वन टू वन साइन एक्स का वैल्यू तो माइनस वन टू वन में होता ही है ना फॉर विच वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स फॉर ऑल रियल वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स दैट मीन्स दिस फंक्शन हैज दो मेन ऑल रियल नंबर ये फंक्शन एक्स की किसी भी रियल वैल्यू के लिए डिफाइंड होगा दैट मीन्स जो ग्राफ है वो एक्स एक्सिस के ऊपर ऑल रियल नंबर के लिए होगा and on y axis it has limits between minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 based on this discussion let's create a table we have a value of n in this equation we will put different values of n for that we will find different relations and from that relation we will find values of x for which that relation is valid here is the graph paper okay now let's start with value of n is equal to 0 put n is equal to 0 so what relation we get from this equation we get y is equal to x now limitation on values of y is there minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 so the values of x will also lie in that interval so here are values of x what this means this means the graph of this function will be a straight line y is equal to x for this values of x so here is the graph for this particular section minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 it is a straight line passing through origin making an angle 45 degree with positive x axis that means slope is 1 let's try different value of n say n is equal to 1 what relation you get we get y is equal to pi minus x now how you calculate values of x from the limitation on values of y the values of y are minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 so we have pi minus x lying between minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 we can calculate subtract pi from all sides we have minus 3 pi by 2 less than or equal to minus x less than or equal to minus pi by 2 multiply throughout by minus sign we have values of x lying between pi by 2 to 3 pi by 2 that means this relation is valid for x belongs to pi by 2 to 3 pi by 2 so we will draw the graph of this function for this interval which is straight line having slope minus 1 for x is equal to pi by 2 y is equal to pi by 2 so we have point here for x is equal to 3 pi by 2 value of y is minus pi by 2 so we have point 3 pi by 2 minus pi by 2 here so we have this straight line 
as a graph of this function. Next value, let's take n is equal to minus 1. For this, we get uh, from this relation, y is equal to minus pi minus x. Knowing the limitation on values of y, we can calculate values of x. Aap calculate kar sakte hain. Kya are values of x? x belongs to minus 3 pi by 2 to minus pi by 2. This is straight line having slope minus 1 for this interval. So here is the graph. Okay. Next value, say n is equal to 2. For that we get relation y is equal to 2 pi plus x. Calculating the values of x, we get x belongs to minus 5 pi by 2 to minus 3 pi by 2. This interval ke liye graph draw karenge. y is equal to 2 pi plus x, jiska slope 1 hai. So here is the graph. Similarly, we can try other values, say n is equal to minus 2. What relation we get? y is equal to minus 2 pi plus x. For this, values of x are kya are x ki values? x belongs to 3 pi by 2 to 5 pi by 2. So we draw the graph for this section now. The straight line having slope 1. So here is the graph. Similarly, we can try for other values of x, 3 minus 3. We can check later on the graph is in the form of triangles. The graph will be repeated now on both sides. Okay. Now we can check this triangle width is 2 pi. The same triangle is repeated further. From this we can conclude the period of this function is 2 pi. That means 2 pi length ke baad ye graph repeat hoga. Also we can check this function is continuous. Is function mein kahi pe bhi koi break nahi hai. Hai na? But this function has sharp turns. At x is equal to minus pi by 2, pi by 2, 3 pi by 2. In sabhi x ki values ke liye hum keh sakte hain ki function is non-differentiable. Hum jaante hain na ki jahaan pe graph ko sharp turn hota hai, wahaan pe function non-differentiable hota hai. We cannot draw a unique tangent to function at this values of x. So, function is non-differentiable at 2n plus 1 pi by 2 where n belongs to z.